What's up everybody? Today I'm going to be showing you how to make trap style hi-hats in FL Studio. Before we get into that, go ahead and take a second to check out our new website, atolostudios.com. You can find more tutorials, you can download beats, there's forums, and it'll be updated regularly. So anyway, this is a really easy process. Um, first things first, you load up your hi-hat, which I already have done. You're going to right click, and you're going to go to the piano roll. So let's play our beat without the hi-hat, and then um, we're going to go from there. Alright, so to start out, I'm just going to put one hi-hat hit on each downbeat of the measure. Control, you can click and drag to highlight, and if you hold shift, it'll copy, or rather duplicate. You can move it over and that'll fill everything up. You want to make sure you've got all your uh, MIDI notes right on the beat, that way nothing gets messed up as you duplicate it. So, one of the things that's very distinctive about trap beats is that the hi-hats can get pretty crazy. Faster, slower, triplets, things panned. So, to start, we're just going to make sure that we have more hi-hat. Now let's make it more interesting. If we highlight these, you can resize them all together. Hold shift and duplicate. And over here we're going to do a triplet. So that's not shrunk quite enough. Take all these. That should do it. Sounds a little better. We're basically halfway done with our hi-hat loop now. Um, we could just copy that and have it go through, but that would get kind of repetitive and boring. So our second half of this, um, this measure, this loop, this uh, section, we'll call it, we're going to vary so that um, it keeps our listener interested. Do another triplet here. And we'll do another triplet here. I'm just going to duplicate that. And these ones here, I'm going to do uh, one of those like real speedy hi hat parts. Maybe with a pause at the end. So that's okay. That sounds interesting. 
but we want to make it a little bit more exciting. So one thing you can do is take um, an open hi-hat sound or something that's a little bit different and put it on just a few beats and then pan it. I've already created that, so I'm just going to show you. We have our open hi-hat. It's right here. So if we add that, it sounds like this. A little more interesting. Um, I haven't panned that hi-hat. Maybe I will, but first, what I'm going to do is these really fast hi-hat rolls. Um, I'm going to pan those so that there's movement, and I'm going to show you an interesting trick where you can pan your instrument right in the piano roll. So you're going to go right up here to this little down arrow. You're going to go Target, Control, and you want to go to Note Pan. Now down in your control area, you can click and drag, and it'll allow you to move from left to right with your notes. So when you play it back, when everything's centered, it sounds like this. When it's panned, you hear it move. You can do that with um, almost anything that goes into FL Studio Sampler as well as native FL Studio plugins. It doesn't always work with um, third-party VSTs. Contact, I have some issues sometimes with this control working. Um, if it doesn't work though, you can alternately choose target control channel panning and that should allow you to control the pan that way. So once we've panned that one, we're going to do the other one in the opposite direction. Make it more interesting. And let's hear our uh, loop back now. Now let's take that open hi-hat, we're going to pan that also, and I'm just going to alternate left and right on every other one. Get a little bit of bounce, a little bit of a swing feel. And that's really it to do a basic trap hi-hat NFL studio. Really easy to do. Um, you can get more fancy with it and do some uh, pitch variations and other automated controls, which I'll show you in a different video. But for today, I hope that helped out somebody. Thank you for tuning in. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel, click the like button, and check out atolostudios.com for more videos to download beats and all sorts of other cool free things coming soon. Mm -hmm.